Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. Eglin Air Force Base, renowned for its contributions to cutting-edge aviation research and development, marked a significant milestone on April 1, 2024, as the 96th and 53rd wings welcomed the inaugural batch of three F-16 Fighting Falcons. These aircraft will serve as the cornerstone for the innovative Viper Experimentation and Next-Gen Operations Model, Autonomy Flying Testbed, Venom AFT, initiative, aiming to revolutionize the evaluation of autonomous flight software for combat aircraft. Venom AFT stands as a strategic program backed by substantial investment, dedicated to expediting the assessment of autonomous flight capabilities across both manned and unmanned platforms. Leveraging Eglin's existing expertise in autonomy and artificial intelligence research, the initiative is poised to elevate collaborative combat aircraft efforts and provide invaluable insights to developers spearheading autonomous technologies. Major Ross Elder, the Venom Development Test Lead, underscored the program's significance in advancing aerial combat technologies, emphasizing its potential to introduce groundbreaking autonomous capabilities for present and future aircraft. The initiative seeks to chart new horizons in aviation by exploring the integration of autonomous systems into combat operations. The next phase of the Venom initiative entails the transformation of these F-16s into experimental platforms tailored to facilitate swift evaluations of autonomous flight functionalities. Major developmental and operational assessments will be conducted in alignment with established procedures for F-16 and F-15 evaluations at Eglin, involving the collaborative efforts of the 40th Flight Test Squadron and the 85th Test and Evaluation Squadron. Lieutenant Colonel Jeremy Castor, overseeing operational testing for Venom, highlighted the advantages of conducting both developmental and operational evaluations in close proximity. This approach fosters enhanced collaboration and facilitates the seamless exchange of insights and experiences between testing units. Throughout the trials, pilots will oversee autonomous systems from the cockpit, ensuring adherence to testing objectives and mission protocols. Emphasizing the importance of human oversight in autonomous operations, Lt. Col. Joe Gagnon, commander of the 85th TES, reiterated the human-in-the-loop approach. Pilots' continuous involvement ensures the safe and effective execution of autonomous missions, with their feedback playing a pivotal role in refining system performance and decision-making algorithms. The F-16 Fighting Falcon, a stalwart in military aviation since its inception in 1978, boasts remarkable performance and versatility. Equipped with a Pratt & Whitney F-100 PW-229 turbofan engine, the F-16 exhibits exceptional speed, agility, and firepower, making it an ideal candidate for automation initiatives like Venom AFT. Its widespread proliferation worldwide, including upcoming deliveries to countries like Ukraine, underscores the global interest in advancing autonomous capabilities. As the Venom initiative progresses, the Air Force remains steadfast in its commitment to fostering rapid deployment and operational readiness of autonomous technologies. With safety as a paramount concern, Eglin Air Force Base continues to spearhead efforts to propel the Air Force's knowledge and capabilities in autonomous technology and weaponry into the future. That's all for now. See you later.